This is Gary Gravidor and welcome to a bite of the Big Apple. Today I'm going to talk to you about the top 10 things that you might like about New York City. Number 1. New York City's subway and other public transport systems. New York City is the only place in America where we have an extensive public transport system. Over here, you don't necessarily have to own a car because you can always get from point A to point B without having to drive your own vehicle. You can always take the subway, the LIRR train, the bus, the taxi, the limo, or even a helicopter. Unlike most railroad transport systems in the world, where there are certain zone rates or fair charges on a particular zone, meanwhile here at the New York City subway, there is only a standard flat rate of $2.75 per passenger that already goes a long way from either any of the Bronx or Queens terminus to any of the Brooklyn terminus. Number two, pizza. Your New York City experience will never be whole without tasting a slice of the New York City pizza. New York City is home to hundreds of sliced joints, pizzerias and pizza restaurants serving the city's iconic and unique pizza. The New York style slice came about as a result of a Neapolitan style pizza when Italian immigrants introduced pizza to New York City and America in the early 1900s. New York style pizza has slices that are large and wide with a thin crust that is foldable yet crispy. Just plain cheese. We call this a planer or regular pizza. All we do because of the thin crust is we fold it like this and we eat it. Okay? Number three, convenience. Do you need to go to a bank, a pharmacy, a barber shop, or just an ATM? Do you need to buy a hot cup of coffee on the way, a box of sushi for lunch, or a metro card but don't want to go to the subway station? Then New York City has it all. Every nook and cranny of the city is loaded with stores and establishments that meet your needs in a New York minute. The city is also accessible to a person with disability. Number four, shopping. As the fashion capital of the United States, it is so easy to shop till you drop here in New York City. Number 5. New York City is a melting pot. One of the perks of living here in New York City is the fact that you get to see a little bit of everybody from around the world. I mean, literally, a little bit of everybody from around the world. Across the five boroughs, New York City speaks an estimated 800 languages, from Garifuna and Urdu to Bosnian. The city is a glorious, one-of-a-kind melting pot, and you can literally hear it all around you. Number six, iconic landmarks. New York City is rich with so many iconic landmarks and historic places that are famous not only here in America, but also in the whole world. Number 7. New Yorkers for many years now, New Yorkers have been misjudged 
and stereotyped for being a bunch of jerks. A lot of people have misconstrued as New York is to be rude or obnoxious, but I don't think we are a rude or obnoxious bunch. It's just that we're in a constant rush or in a hurry, and we do not want people to slow us down to get to our point of destination. That's all. If you are a tourist and you wanted to approach a local, then you need to be forthright or direct with your question, because a typical New Yorker doesn't have enough time in the world to exchange pleasantries with you. A typical New Yorker's day is packed with a personal schedule. Believe it or not, we New Yorkers are so much willing to help people, but you also need to respond to our help in a New York Minute. Number 8. Culture New York City is a different vibe and culture. The people here love the culture of New York, the sights and sounds and everything. You have Broadway, you have fashion, you have museums, everything. You name it, New York City has it. The glitz and glamour of New York City are always spectacular and larger than life. And its wow factor is always a life imitating art. Number nine, the place. New York City has the energy level that's just like no other. It is a city that never sleeps. It is the cultural, financial, and media capital of the world that significantly influences commerce, entertainment, research, technology, education, politics, tourism, art, fashion, and sports. It is home to the headquarters of the United Nations and an important center for international diplomacy. And finally, number 10, anything goes in New York City. For as long as you don't violate the laws of the land, whenever you come to New York City, you need to come as you are, make yourself feel comfortable and feel like home. Well, I guess this is it for now. Thank you very much for tuning in and for watching this episode. In the meantime, please take good care of yourselves, stay healthy, and pray always. Que Dios te bendiga, hoy y siempre. Gracias a todos.